Hey Nancy, how are you? Good. How are you? Good, thank you. Well, I'm happy to talk get to talk to the the rad British boy of Space Cadet. <laughs> so tell me about getting to be uh in this film and getting to play that character that is so focused in career has lacked a little fun yeah i mean so in terms of, we didn't know initially when the script it wasn't written that he was british you know so that was kind of something that got added in once i was cast liz was like you know how do you feel about him being british and i was like that could work um i in my head i was so when i read it it was going to be that he was american so I kind of had to like turn it and then I started to really love the idea because, you know, he's a, a sort of a British, you know, highly educated guy who's now, you know, been an astronaut, works in NASA. Um, and then the idea of someone like him meeting this crazy Florida girl and falling for her, I could kind of like, I can see, you know, because there's something so, I think with the, the Brits, there's something about Americans anyway, there's this kind of like, I don't know, like a kind of a magical element to it because we only ever see them in movies and stuff, right? So when you come up against them, so when a girl like Rex, I think it was quite, it's so different for him, let alone who he's seen in NASA. You know, this girl is so unique to him. And I think what's quite cool about Logan is he's actually, you know, he's a bit of a Clark Kent in that he's he's actually, that's that's his, I feel like this is his front when he's at NASA. I don't think that's truly who he is. I think that's the front, that's his professional front. And actually Rex brings out a former self of him. I think it's a, the person that he, he really wants to be. Hence the karaoke and all that stuff. You know, I think he sees a part of himself in Rex that he wants to bring out, but he doesn't know how. And she's, she's that access point. Emma does it so well uh, with her character. So what, what were there times where you were just like admiring that personality? Like some of us, you know, get, you know, caught up and focused in career and we kind of forget about that. Yeah, I think that's the thing is like, um, I mean, I've got friends who when they're at work, they can't figure out the play part. And I, I feel it's like so important to have the play and like work hard, play hard, right? I think that's the, the balance. And uh, I think that's what Rex is for for Logan. You know, she's she's got that that personality that allows him to to loosen up, bring the tie down. Now I'm curious for the karaoke. What is your karaoke song? Of uh, choice? My go to song, my first one I usually start with in any karaoke is uh, uh, "Tribute" by Tenacious D. That's the start, and then what's the ending? <laughs> the ending. Bohemian Rhapsody, probably. Classic. You yeah. have great taste. Yeah, I like to think so. <laughs> well, thank you so much for your time. Congratulations with Space Cadet. And people are going to be loving the rad British boy. Thanks, Nancy. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye-bye.